Dan Rain. This is Lou Riley coming at you from Nashville, Tennessee. I'm actually driving down Music Row in Nashville, a bunch of recording studios and publishing houses and attorneys and such. Excuse the shades, but it's 90 some odd degrees here in Nashville. It's pretty warm, but definitely wanted to let you see who exactly I am. Listen, this is obviously my submission for the for your internship program. I want to be a part of it. Why? Well, I've been a part of the 30 day challenge for this is my third year going into it and I've learned a heck of a lot. I've been able to apply a lot. Uh, I've been parts of groups of marketers and I tend to stand out because of some of the things I've been able to do with getting search engine rankings and putting out quality web point web 2.0 uh, uh, content that I learned basically through the teachings that you and the crew of the 30 day challenge have given out. I clearly uh, am above the average online marketer, but more so than that, I want to be a part of this challenge because, you know, there's something in me that's connected to something greater than me that is still yearning to express itself and I'm one who takes a look at timing and opportunities as they present themselves at particular times and I figured that when you put that offer out it was the perfect moment for me to step out and to find out whether this is the moment or one of the moments for me to express that part of me that wants to do more, that wants to be more, that wants to have more. I think the most valuable thing that will come out of the internship program, should I be so fortunate to be selected, is number one, the contacts or the network that I'm going to become a part of, and maybe 1A or 1B is the knowledge that I'm going to gain for being around yourself and other marketers who are much more knowledgeable than I am. I grew up uh, an athlete. I played American football, basketball, football being my, my love. And I mention that because that gave me the discipline and the understanding of how to be a good teammate, how to accept constructive criticism, and how to go about working with groups of people, even though you may not agree with them, you can agree to disagree. And you never know, you find out so many things from others until sometimes you realize it may be good that you set aside your own personal thoughts and feelings in order to allow for someone else to express themselves. So I want to bring a level of enthusiasm to the group, a high level of it, as I'm just, uh, you know, a lot of things on self-help and motivation and things of that nature. I'm a never say die kind of guy. And I want to bring that to the table and want to end by thanking you for this opportunity. Thank you for even watching this video. And I'm just going to leave it on the decision making process and I'm hopeful that I'm going to get a return call, get a return email, uh, a return Skype message <laughs> or a Skype message, hey, what have you. But hey, thanks a lot. Look forward to hearing more from you and I'll definitely continue to check you guys out. You take care.